possibility even existing. That's best for the country. That's what they think. You, you just didn't say that, right? Huh? You just didn't say that, right? Who? You. That's what they think. They think they're doing what's best for the country. We can disagree. No. Yeah. Even husbands and wives disagree and stay married. If, you're, if our friendship is based on my sufferings, then we are not <laughs> On my oppression, my suffering. <laughs> Thank you guys for checking in to Think Museums. If this is your first time on this channel, please go ahead, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell. And like, comment, share, you know, all that good stuff. But today, I'm in Los Angeles, California. I'm checking out some of the monuments and landscapes here in the West Coast. Today, I'm here in... You know, on Mount Lee, this is Mount Lee, and I'm checking out that Hollywood sign on top there. That sign was set up in 1923, and it was called the Hollywood Land Sign. It was used to advertise for a real estate that was segregated. Yeah, that's some piece of info there. It was a segregated real estate that that sign was um, advertising. But we are up here on... Uh, Griffith Observatory and this is the best place for you to be able to check out the um, you know downtown LA and see how it looks like um, because it gives you a 360 view of Los Angeles you can see how it is from up here uh, the Griffith Observatory was set up in I believe 1935 um, and it's mostly used for astronomy so they have like three giant telescopes um, in there and I read somewhere that uh, they're talking about over three, uh, no, over seven million people have used that giant telescope. Oh, I just zoomed on the downtown LA. It looks cool. Um, so over seven million people have used that giant telescope. Uh, I think it's called the Zeiss telescope or something like that. But when this place was, um, you know, inaugurated in 1935, the founder wished for it to be a place where everybody can come and use the facilities. So actually the Griffith Observatory is very free to the general public. You can come here, check it out and you know, use the giant telescope that are here. The good thing is that when you're up here at the Griffith Observatory, you can check out, you see that's the three telescope I was talking about, the top one, two, three, those three things that look like a rotunda. Um, that's where the telescopes open up from there. Yeah, so I was saying that um, when you're up here, you can see the Hollywood sign just across. So you can see it across there. That's the Hollywood sign. Um, I just like, you know, where this, how this place was set up. It's in a very strategic location. It gives you a 360 view of, you know, downtown LA and its surrounding. Um, and it's a good place because uh, you can come up here, do your hiking, you know, it has some good trails. Um, but this is how it looks like, uh, the Griffiths Observatory. Um, last time I was, I visited um, an observatory was in um, Flagstaff, Arizona, and I checked out the Lowell Observatory. It's one of the observatories that is very popular because um, they discovered Pluto at the Lowell observatory but i don't know if they have discovered anything here at the lower uh, at the griffith observatory yeah but this is how it looks like it's um it's pretty cool um next time when i go to the lowell observatory in uh, flagstaff arizona i'll make sure to um, create some content for you guys so you can check it out so oh look at that there's a helicopter it's just gonna go right on top of the hollywood sign that's pretty cool I like that. Look at that. That's cool. Yeah, so next time um, I'm in Arizona, I'll make sure that I check out the Loyal Observatory in Flagstaff and I'll bring more content. Um, it's a giant telescope they have out there and it's a good piece of history too on how they discovered Pluto. So, but today, because of pandemic, um, this particular uh, Griffith Observatory is closed, uh, temporarily closed, and I hope that next time when I'm here, it's going to be open and I can check out the giant telescopes that are inside there um, so that I can be part of that number, the 7 million people that have used 
the telescope here at the Griffith Observatory. But look at that. It looks cool. You know, when you're here and you're looking at downtown LA, you know, look at that. I tried zooming, zoom, zoom, zoom like that. Yeah, it looks cool. Um, yeah, so thank you guys for being with me. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe and let's keep connected.